my fellow graduates, it is truly an honor to be standing here in front of you today. It has been a long journey, and we finally made it. It feels like yesterday that we walked into high school for the first time, and now it's already time to leave. This is a big chapter of our lives ending, but it is also the beginning of a new one. Over the past three years at ESDH, we have been through a lot together, making new friends and becoming distant with old ones. We've experienced many ups and downs, and it has never ceased to amaze me how everyone comes together and supports one another. It's been a long three years, and it's been a short three years. Long because of the hours of homework and all of the assignments that we did. Short because of the lifelong friendships we created, cheering on our teams at sporting events, and all of the lasting memories that we made. Unfortunately, sometimes we never realize the value of a moment until it becomes a memory. That is why every day we should appreciate what we are given and never take a moment for granted. Because as we know all too well, someone or something can be here one day and gone the next. So as we look back on the past three years, what will we remember? Welcome week, including the Rupier Mile, or maybe it was a favorite teacher giving you advice that changed your life. The week-long fun of carnival hockey, or the friends you made and the adventures you had with them. A very important lesson that many of us learned this year is that when your principal tells you you can't park somewhere, you probably shouldn't park there. <laughs> so how do we measure the time we spent in high school? By the number of friendships we gained? The countless hours of studying? Or the after school practices? We measure it by the good times and the bad times by the memories we've made with our friends. Look around. The people beside you have been there through all of the ups and downs. For the last 13 years, many of us have been on a journey together. Think back to your first day of grade primary. You were most likely scared and you didn't want to leave your parents' side. But during those 13 years, you grew and you learned how to make decisions for yourself. Now, sitting here before me, I see a group of confident young adults ready to take on the world. I hope you're all very proud of yourselves. If there's one thing that I've learned in the past couple of years, it is that life is all about being happy. As we all take steps into the next chapter of our lives, we need to make sure we are doing something we enjoy. We were put on this planet for a reason. I believe that reason is to make a difference in the world, big or small, and to inspire others. Each of us will walk down an individual path and discover why we were put here. Life isn't always going to make sense, but I do believe that everything happens for a reason. I would like to now take a minute to thank the people who helped get us to this day. To our teachers, thank you for all the time, talent, and knowledge you shared with us. Yes, we know it was your job, but many of you went above and beyond, taking the time to explain assignments, sometimes repeatedly because we weren't paying attention. You put in the effort to make lessons more interesting so we wouldn't just tune out. You demanded excellence from us, whether or not we wanted to give it. To our parents, Thank you for supporting us in more ways than it's possible to count. <laughs> you dragged us out of bed each morning, made sure we were fed and clothed for school. You helped us with homework, last minute assignments, and all the projects that we had to do. You came to our dance shows, attended our sporting events, and you chaperoned our class trips. You listened to our daily dramas, 
and you always gave us enough space to learn how to work things out for ourselves. These are just a few of the many ways that you supported us on our journey. Thank you. together as a group. We have made so many amazing memories with each other. And after this summer, some of us may never see each other again. But I guarantee you that 30 years down the road, when you see someone from our graduating class, you will smile at them. Not necessarily because you used to be best friends with that person, but because we are always going to share a special bond with each other. That is why I couldn't ask to be graduating with a more special group of people. I would like to wish you all luck in your future. We began high school as children, and we are now graduating as adults. As we move on with our lives and go our separate ways to college, university, or straight into the workforce, I encourage you all to hold on to the memories you have made and to use these experiences as a foundation on which to build the next chapter of your life. As Dr. Seuss once said, you're off to great places. Today is your day. Your mountain is waiting, so get on your way. It's been a blast, guys. Congratulations to the graduating class of 2014. We did it.